everyone, Joel Anser, and today we're in Chicago, still in Chicago. It's been so cool so far. This place is huge, so many people, like, and just a big, big, big city. Lots and lots of cool stuff to be had. And today we're outside Bridgeport Bakery. Yes, that's right, Bridgeport Bakery 2.0. And this place has been here for like 100 years. It is crazy. They have everything from donuts. They have coffee cakes. They have danishes. They make custom cakes. They make cupcakes. They have everything and anything you want. Pies, breads. It is crazy the amount of stuff they have here, whether it's like Mexican, Chinese, uh, like just so many different ethnicities. And what else is super, super, super cool? Super cool is today we're having a giant, giant donut challenge. So for this challenge today, we have what approximately about eight pounds of donuts. It's considering a variety of their donuts. I'll give you the exact flavors here momentarily. And then they also made us a very big special donut. Yes, they also make big special donuts. So kind of like, uh, you know, if you're having like a birthday party or whatever, you want a big donut, they'll do that for you as well. So like I said, lots of options, lots of donuts. Again, full like eight pounds. Uh, we're only have 30 minutes to do so. We do, we're gonna all the donuts for free, which is pretty awesome. Uh, but yeah, let's give you some more details here momentarily. Uh, they're open like five, seven days a week from 5 a.m., which is crazy. They make everything from scratch. We're talking flour to pastry. So it is just like, it's cool. It is about as fresh, it's legit as you can get. So ultimately, let's go on in, let's have some fun, get you some more info, and uh, let's eat some food. Everyone, so here we are with all the donuts. Like I said, absolutely massive, massive tray. So up here we have an absolutely giant custom-made Long John, which has my name on it, which is super cool. Again, you can make, uh, like, order any kind of custom donut you want. We then have a traditional sugar twist. I have a cake donut with a strawberry on top. I have a coconut donut, chocolate cake donut. I then have a chocolate dip cake donut. I have a sprinkle cake donut, a sprinkle yeast donut. I have a chocolate chocolate cake donut. I have a jelly donut. We have a traditional chocolate dip donut. I got a cinnamon bun, iced cinnamon bun. I have an iced apple cinnamon bun. I have some donut holes. I have a cruller dipped in chocolate, a French cruller. I have a pretzel donut. I have a white coconut donut. Uh, I have a toasted coconut donut. I have a little swirl. This is like a really cool pastry thing filled with cherries. We have multiple Lawn Johns up here. I have a Boston cream. I have one of their famous almond donuts. And even one of their more famous maple bacon donuts. Yes, yeah, so, you know, I'm maple. Maybe it's just because I'm Canadian, who knows? Stereotypical, it's totally cool. But that, I'm so excited. Lots of donuts, so let's get started here. Wish me luck, it's a lot of food. And uh, let's eat some donuts. I like sweets, we're going straight to dessert today. Hi everyone, so let's get started. 30 minutes, officially on the clock. So how about we get started? Let's say the count of five. Four, three, I don't know where to start. One, let's go. Always one of my favorite. I love a cooler. Do you want a hole? Donut. Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we're here at Bridgeport. Yes, that's right, Bridgeport Bakery here in Chicago. Really excited to be in Chicago and here we were doing a massive donut challenge. So it's not too often I get to do a, such a kind of, we'll say, dessert or sweet challenge. Um, so having something like this was really great and I'm very, very thankful for the opportunity. So a really cool spot. Not only do they literally make everything under the sun, I'm talking every kind of bread, every kind of pie, every kind of cake, every kind of donut, every kind of pastry, every kind of anything and like anything and everything you could want. They literally made here at this shop. So that was I was super impressed with. It was very, very diverse. I mean, they even had like, um, like dumplings, like Chinese dumplings. Um, then they said they had some Mexican style breads. It was really, really impressive um, in the sense that they literally just had so many different, uh, we'll say cultures, items um, and they all looked very delicious and here of course we got to try a number of different donuts um, to which I will also say were very delicious uh, as I went through all the kinds there we had some cake donuts we had some yeast donuts um, and pretty much everything you know kind of all in between the cake donuts are really good super moist the yeast are light and fluffy Jelly donut. Woo. Very good. Try one of the 
cinnamon buns. Mm. Oh yeah. Ooh. So soft, so cinnamony. Fire. Straight fire. So I love donuts. I'm definitely a donut person. Preferably I uh, like a yeast risen donut. Um, although I understand, you know, again, the, the cake ones were really good as well. Just kind of a preference. I prefer a yeast risen donut, um, but both are really nice. The cake donuts were moist. Uh, what else I really liked here is the crullers. I love crullers, like a, you know, like a honey cruller or a cruller donut. Those were also very, very delicious. Um, what I was so excited for is like all the fa these fancy ones. You see, there were some really cool flavors covered in almonds. Um, we had the uh, the maple bacon. Um, you know, everything was really delicious. And of course, uh, we had some couple like cinnamon buns and like every like I said, everything far and just in between. Um, the flavors were really nice. The donuts were really great. They do cook everything every single day. So you're never getting like a day old donut. You're not getting a day old bread. Um, they're literally making everything. That I, they said they bake like it's basically overnight, you know, from, I don't know, midnight to 5 a.m. or something, which is absolutely crazy. And they make everything from scratch, like everything. Coconut. Okay. That works. I love coconut. Shout out my mom. My mom loves coconuts too. And coconut donuts. And then they also have the big donuts. Um, so like the, the big one they made for me, but they also do like big rounds and et cetera. Um, one thing I will also mention is the price. The affordability of donuts were absolutely insane. Most of the donuts were like a dollar something, like which is unheard of because most places have donuts at like three, four dollars. And these were all so affordable. So definitely another reason to go buy. Chocolate sprinkles. Oh, sweet, both it down. Here. So if you want anything, definitely pre-order. You can pre-order by like 8 p.m. the day before and it'll be ready the next morning as early as like 5 a.m. Um, additionally, they will actually ship UPS to all the surrounding states such as Michigan, Indiana, Wisconsin, um, all through Illinois, etc. So you can get your baked goods next day anywhere. I have so many options. I was trying one of these long johns, little long johns. Delicious. Yeah, super nice, light, fluffy yeast donut. But yeah, definitely a great place to grab some baked goods. You know, everything's made from scratch. Again, preservative free, uh, made fresh every day. Um, and then they actually do some like specialties around like Christmas and Fat Tuesday, etc. Just hold that. So with that, I want to hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Hopefully we can get the meal for free by completing this challenge. And uh, at that, I'll let you get to it. I hope you enjoy, and uh, let's see what happens. About seven to sim, very, very good. No shortage of donut, lots of food, but it's all fantastic. Like, delicious. But I feel the sugar already. About nine and a half minutes in. I got these two left. This is the apple cinnamon bun. This is the owner's favorite. The maple bacon. And this monster. This is a beast of a donut. So that's what I'm a little nervous for. All right. 
Maple bacon. Woo! That is sweet, smoky, savory. That's a bite. Fisherman Sim, we're getting through it. This long john is huge, but I will say, they're like I said, the, the cake donuts are well known for. But those yeast donuts, that's one of my favorites, and they are fire. They're so light, so fluffy. I see why this is considered one of the best kept secret donut places. That is my face. I have a big face. There. It's like bacon and coconut. Uh, Excuse me. Compliments to all the chefs and bakers. For those who can't understand full mouth speak, compliments to all the chefs and bakers. Are done. Just uh, maybe 15 minutes, 49 seconds. So that everybody. Huge thanks everybody came out. Really appreciate the support, guys. Thank you everybody for watching. It is about 90 degrees out today, so it's a little warm. So again, I appreciate everybody uh, enjoying the heat. Appreciate taking the time of day to come watch. I will say, Bridgeport, man, they got some good donuts. I think my favorites today were the uh, maple bacon. The cinnamon roll, that was so damn good, so soft, just like ripped apart. Anything to do with like the yeast donuts were just exceptionally soft, super, super good. Again, making everything here. So those are my favorites today. Definitely recommend coming on by. Again, if you ever need a cake or a big donut, like they'll make you a big round one or one like that. They got it all. But yeah, huge thanks to everybody here. The staff is fantastic. And um, shout out Chicago. Chicago's been great. So everybody, of course, till next time, say happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating. Like I said, definitely come try some donuts or some pies or cakes or danishes. They have everything. Maybe don't eat this many donuts. In fact, just don't eat this many donuts. You don't need to, I do it so you don't have to. Um, but yeah, that's about it, everybody. Really loved it, great experience. And uh, that, till next time, have eating. Obviously it looks really dark, but here we are down at uh, Fullerton Beach. There we go, we got the uh, the Chicago um, skyline, more or less. And uh, down there we have the Navy Pier. There's that Ferris wheel, so that, there goes the Ferris wheel. And uh, they shoot fireworks off, so like I said, we're going to uh, see the fireworks. Apparently this is a good place to see them. So, let's wait for some fireworks. I like fireworks. some of the fireworks.
You get the idea. And some of the finale. It was a big show. Dang nabbit cat, you're gonna be down the menu next week if you don't shut up. So everybody, thanks so much for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed. Click my face right here to subscribe. And also I picked two videos. That's right, two videos just for you that you might like. Right here. So like I said guys, hit that subscribe, hit one of these videos, do it right now. Until next time, have a lovely day.